It is 12 13 p.m. 13 minutes after the drop and I've officially sold out. out of stock out of stock out of stock If I'm being honest, this isn't a very profitable business like I'm really just breaking even I just like doing this because it's really fun and I get to give you guys your forever pieces I'm finally back after like a five six I don't even know how many month long hiatus and today was the second drop of my watches so i dropped 40 watches i got a lot of dms saying that the site was lagging is this even focused i f fucking hate this camera sometimes on my end the website wasn't lagging i just had to keep refreshing it to see what was selling out and i know there's been a lot of questions about the website like entering your details and saving your details in an account and i've tried i've tried i've tried but godaddy is literally shit i don't like that platform at all but i paid for it so now i'm stuck with it i've had a lot of overwhelmed feelings these days i don't know where they're stemming from like sometimes i get so stressed it becomes like a tight feeling like in my chest like i just have to like kind of like go into myself and whenever i feel this way i try to journal so let's get into that I redid my entire room like it's very minimal very clean at the moment. It's kind of dusty I could have cleaned it up and shown you guys a perfect picture perfect aesthetic room right now I'm not picture perfect and my room just perfectly captures my mental state right now and I forgot my microphone You see what I mean like I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Why is the exposure so low? I'm in my last year of college mentally. I'm still 17. I have bills. I'm an adult after this year is when real life begins and that thought just terrifies the fuck out of me since i've done this whole like new room revamp thing i have this corner that i'm so proud of she is literally beauty she is grace even with these dead flowers it's kind of a vibe so i got my driver's license this summer and i think we all know that i despise driving i hate it i will not do it i only got my license to appease people so these were the flowers that i received for it these are just stickers for my new brand. They all just say the Kismet Reserve. I came up with this a few days after like a tragic event had happened, which is why this project shop kind of means a lot to me. It came to fruition after a sad event. Nonetheless, after said sad event, I was just thinking about, you know, how things are meant to be. God wills it all. God knows the plan. Everything is fated. Everything is written. You know, there's the Arabic word maktub, but I'm not Arab. So like, why would I use that? What's in Urdu that means the same thing? And then boom, I was like, Kismet. Duh. And I feel like that's the perfect word because it's in English, it's in Turkish, it's in Hindi, Urdu, whatever. People know what that word means. Reserve came to be. Shop, store, all of that was taken up. And then I was like, why not reserve? It sounds fancy, it sounds clean, it sounds elegant, and it sounds kind of old. In a good way. Like the vintage watches. I'm actually wearing some right now. This one just got sold today in the drop. This one I found and I just fell in love with it and I'm like, I need to keep this one. I'm pretty sure you guys can tell that my cat is quite crippled. I don't know what animal she got into a fight with, but she has a really nasty gash on her head and it keeps filling up with puff. <laughs> now she's a cone head. Can you stop it? I have to give you a warm compress. It was gross. This pus was just oozing out. It was disgusting. Now I have to warm compress her. You know that TikTok audio where it's like, your ears will fall off, your limbs will... Can I just have one second? Like one second to myself. Yeah, whatever. I was also mad when I had to pay $500. That could have been so easily avoided if people in this house just closed the doors. Yellow. So I actually have a lot of watches that I want to show you guys. Since I just sold out today, I'm not going to start shipping and packing until tomorrow. I have been stocking up on watches to last me for a few drops. I know I dropped 40 watches this time around, but I feel like that's the max I can do. And even that was kind of stretching it out a bit for me. Given that I have school and now I'm like trying to find a job and all these other things in my life, being a content creator, I might cut it down to 30 just to make it easier on me. These are some unseen watches. I have a couple of cool ones I'm gonna pull out my sleeve. Obviously I can't show all my cards. Look at how cute this one is. And it's a working watch too. I am so tempted to keep it. That's another thing, it's really hard for me to share these watches because they're all so beautiful and I really just wanna keep them. You guys are gonna scream at this next one. I love this, it's like a porcelain watch. A lot of the times I consult my friends on whether I should like get 
a certain watch. One of my friends said that this is something her grandma would wear, and if anything, I took that as a reason to buy it. Whenever I show this one to people, they say that it's their favorite. You know, it just looks like a bracelet, nothing fancy, and then boom, you have a little watch that flips out. Okay, I love this little ruby detailing in it too. Like, what is stopping me from keeping this? I have everyone's favorite, and I've happened to acquire a lot of them. We have the peekaboo watches. So I'm planning on selling two in every drop, just so it's more fair, and also so I don't run out of them so quickly. These are very difficult to come across. I'm so lucky that I've even found all these with the different keywords I've used to search them up, and I've had to negotiate these prices down a lot. Like, at the end of the day, I don't want to charge too much for a watch. Look at these. Like, this yellow one reminds me of a mango. This one is red. This one is one that I sold today. Alright, so we all know that I have my Gucci bezel watch, right? I will never be selling her because I got it as a birthday present, and I also will not be sourcing them to resell on my page because they're just so expensive, and I just feel like it's not worth it. I won't lie, I wanted that watch out of the hype that was around it, but if I had known watches like this were out there and they're metal and they're vintage and also just as cool if not cooler and cheaper i would have wanted something like this instead i still love that watch don't get me wrong but for instance we have miss ann klein over here i love this pink bezel and there are also six more colors i want to put two bezel sets in each drop and i think i'll be putting this set in next week's drop on the 24th 12 p.m eastern time this was the bezel watch i sold in today's drop i love that it's an interchangeable strap and bezel watch very sad to see this one go because of course I would have wanted to keep it. This is the last piece I'm going to show you guys and I want an opinion on it. So this is also an interchangeable watch but it's not bezels or straps but rather it's these stones at the end. So right now there's purple but there's also brown, white, and black. This is very unique. I've never seen anything like it before. I'm thinking should I put this in this week's drop or should I put a different bezel watch? I don't know guys. Let me know. I feel so bad. She's just there in her little cone. She can't even lay down properly. She ruptured her little abscess all over my bed and it smells rancid. I had to wear a mask in the car when I first smelt it. It was disgusting. I'm not really doing anything exciting for the rest of the day. I'm just in my house, withering away. At least I get to wither away with my watches. I feel like time is just passing by so fast and it's such a strange feeling. You blink and three months have just passed by. And me starting this brand is me trying to like find my purpose and kind of slow time down while still having fun. I'm kind of igniting that spark back with social media that I feel like I might have lost. I mean, hey, it's working. I'm back on YouTube, so I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. It was a pretty short and sweet vlog. I wanted to quit recording like five times. Please comment some more video suggestions. I'm excited to get back into this. Bye guys.